Hi there, this is the circuit I've been working on actually um, and I'll show you it, I'll show it to you in a while um, I've uh, removed just one part of this which is this part um, which shows an LED to, to show you if it's powered or not instead I'll just put a switch here to turn on the power and since I can't find a 390k I'm using a 391k resistor for R5 basically the rest is the same it's showing here a transformer but they never mention uh, what kind although it's a center tap and I tried the the 12 volts 12012 and uh, I've been getting only 84 volts with no load so instead um, I'm using this one let's see yeah it's uh, 9 plus 9 with the center tap and with this on this circuit <clears throat> which I will show in the next part of my video uh, I'm getting 107 volts out of it uh, I couldn't find a smaller uh, like prob if I step this down to 606 center tap um, it will probably be heating up the the transistor shear anyway as I said this is the circuit I've been working on right now <clears throat> with some notes over here as I said <clears throat> I'm I took out this LED in the light indicator because it eats up battery <clears throat> and of course just to make sure I'm <clears throat> putting a separate heat sink on this and as my notes there on the <clears throat> 12012 I'm getting only 81 volts <clears throat> crude computation here mm, power factor <clears throat> 12 versus the 9 volts is 1.33 we look at the 33 here and yes actually I'm getting 107 volts out of it all right uh, next part will be the video of the running circuit welcome again uh, I'm still on a testing mode on this one but looks like a fairly good circuit to run unfortunately the the IC 4047B is hidden under <clears throat> my jumper wires uh, this is running off um, eight double uh, A batteries you have the transformer here and you have this CFL uh, 7.5 watt bulb it also runs on the 18 watt uh, CFL over here and uh, about 90% oh 95% brightness on the Utilitech bulb so it's still in the testing stage um, there's a capacitor a Miler capacitor there and uh, with it running um, AC is about 85 for this particular lamp and for that LED it should go up to about 90-91 while the other one which is an 18 watt is about uh, it will show around 57 volts more or less running on uh, 12 volt uh, AA batteries in series and if you look at the the 
temperature of the transistors it's running cold 65.4 degrees um, eventually I'll be putting the circuit into a uh, PC board uh, of course I'll put a heat sink here just in case somebody plugs in a higher wa uh, wattage bulb just to keep the temperature down uh, so far it will, this one probably handles uh, a good a good size uh, lamp let me take this out so that I'll show you this is what the voltage is like uh, it's output is about well on a fully charged battery pack it's about 107 volts AC uh, there you go it's at 105 right now off of this battery pack I haven't ch uh, tested yet the the how many milliamperes does this circuit eat up for each bulb but I'm happy to say it works on CFLs up to 18 watts equivalent the power consumption um, at I'd say 75% brightness for both uh, there's still some quirky issues with uh, I guess starting it but that will be worked out eventually when I box this up hey thanks for watching all right here's the uh, LED bulb running on the same circuit I'll turn off the light to, to show you how bright it is that's bright and to show you the temperature of the transistors it's still 65 and my voltage here is showing 91 so the LED bulb is eating less than those uh, CFL bulbs but it's great to work with I think I've found something good to box up Later.